Hello, I'm Sarah Collins and welcome to this Yoga Nidra to help you settle into a deep sense of calm and relaxation. Take the next few moments to set up your space. Find somewhere that's safe and comfortable, somewhere that's free from distraction. Find a position, either laying on the floor or laying on a sofa propped up with cushions. And make sure that your body feels really comfortable and supported in this position. You may be in bed to listen to this. Maybe you have a blanket over the body. Maybe a cushion under the head or a cushion under the back of the knees. So take as much time as you need. Maybe even pause this video if you need to. To make sure that you are safe, relaxed and comfortable. So once your body feels comfortable and relaxed, you may like to allow the eyes to close. And sometimes it takes a little while to feel ready to allow the eyes to close. So we don't have to be in any kind of a rush. As you feel the eyelids maybe becoming heavier and shutting, allow the muscles through the eyelids and around the eyes to relax and soften. So there's no straining in the eyes anymore. Allow the muscles all the way across the forehead to let go. Feel the cheeks softening and the jaw allowing itself to let go. Relax the tongue and the throat. And becoming aware of the feeling of your body breathing now. And allowing yourself to take a lovely long Deep breath in with me now. So in through the nose, nice and slowly, all the way up to the top, holding your breath at the top for a moment. And then out through the nose, nice and slow, all the way down to the end. And again, long, deep breath in. Hold and out. One more time, deep breath in. Hold. Returning to just normal breathing. So the chest is relaxed, the lungs are relaxed. There's no forcing. The breath is natural and free. And you may have sensed that those deeper breaths help to 
soften some tightness or rigidity that you may have been holding in the lungs, in the chest. And just know that those longer, deeper breaths are there for you whenever you need them. Over this next little bit of time together, we're here to take the pressure off. And by that I mean, we're going to allow ourselves to accept where we are. So stop fighting where you are in this moment. Stop trying to gain control or fix or improve the way you feel. Don't try to achieve anything, in fact, whilst you're with me for this little bit of time. Don't even try to achieve calm. For it's all this fighting and striving, resisting, attempting, controlling energy that we give that adds another layer of stress and fear and tension to the mix. So while you're here with me, you are off the hook for this time that we have together. There is nothing you need to try to do. Nothing you need to achieve. Nothing you need to control or overcome. And it may feel counterintuitive as I instruct you to do this. But you have tried fighting and you have tried resisting and today I want to invite you to try something you may not have tried before. Surrender. So just for now, surrender to the moment just the way it is. Surrender to where you are today. Surrender to how you are. And allow me to hold this space and time for you. Allow me to hold you for the next little while. Give yourself permission in this moment, right here, right now, to let go of any efforts. As you lay here, you may feel your body just naturally giving its weight over to the support that's beneath you, becoming heavier and sinking more deeply into support. may find that your breath is becoming a little bit more relaxed than it was before. The lungs softening, the chest softening. There's no effort involved in breathing. It's just something that happens without any effort at all. as you watch the breath just come and go all on its own and as you soften and relax into that 
natural flow of breath. You may even notice the breath becoming a little bit more steady, even. Maybe even subtly longer than it was before. And setting your intention now as we move forward together. to just for now take the pressure off. Don't try hard to relax. Don't try hard to control. Release your efforts. Release your expectations. Release your pressure. And just for now, be carried through this time. And we are going to, in a very easy and relaxed way, bring our attention to the body now. Just simply allow yourself to notice the feeling of your own toes. Maybe starting with the big toes on the left and on the right. See if you can just feel their presence. Notice the feeling of them being there. Move along each toe. Don't try to do anything perfectly. Don't try to make anything magical happen here. Just play. Just allow yourself to feel the feeling of your own body. your toes permission to release and relax any tension they may have been holding. And then allow your attention to just run along the bottom of the feet, feeling along the pads of the left foot and then the right foot, feeling along the arches, feeling the presence of the heels, noticing the feeling of the whole of the surface of the bottom of the left foot and the surface of the bottom of the right foot and it's enough to just simply notice nothing more than that needs to happen the muscles along the bottom of the feet to soften their effort to. If they're ready, they're allowed to let go now into softness and easiness. And traveling along the tops of the toes and the tops of the feet
allowing all those little muscles along the tops of the feet to release and relax as you travel along. Moving up into the ankles, feeling into all the little muscles in and around the left ankle. And the right ankle. Bringing our attention fully to the sensation of presence. The presence of the body. The presence of the ankles. giving permission for rigidity or tension to begin to melt away from the body's tissues as there's no effort that needs to be made now moving up from the ankles, feeling along the tops of the legs, along the shins, all the way up to the fronts of the knees. On the left side, on the right side. never trying too hard at anything that we're doing here. Let this be easy. Just play and experiment in the moment. Feeling along the backs of the legs, along the calf muscles, All the way up to the backs of the knees, on the left side, on the right side. giving permission for the calves and the shins to relax. Feeling the presence of the whole of the lower leg on the left side and the foot. The whole of the lower leg and the foot on the right side. into the left knee and the right knee and moving up to the upper leg feeling those big muscles left thigh along the top and along the back hamstrings feeling the presence of the whole of the upper leg and these much larger muscles than the little muscles in the ankles and feet Allow that left 
decide to just let go. Feeling the presence of the right thigh along the top and along the bottom. Giving the right thigh permission to just let go. Feeling into the hip joint on the left side and the right side. into the muscles in the buttocks on the left side, on the right side, allowing these muscles to soften and ease and release their effort. genitals to release and relax any tension they may be holding. up from the waist to the belly, becoming aware of the belly, and allowing the muscles in the belly to release and relax. And even though from time to time the mind comes in in an attempt to take us away from being in the moment with the body. Just know that you don't have to follow the mind to where it wants to take you. And if you do go with the mind it's always okay to breathe out and relax that mental effort, that train of thought and let it just fall away from you once more. So nothing's ever gone wrong. If you lose your concentration a little as we move through this, Try not to get into fight and resistance with the mind. Stay soft and easy. Just softening, relaxing mental efforts just as often as you can. Letting yourself and this process be imperfect. attention back to the belly, letting the, the muscles in the belly soften. And even allowing the organs in the stomach to release, to relax. Allowing the 
chest to relax, allowing the muscles in between the ribs to let go. Maybe even taking a couple of longer, deeper breaths to ease tension away from the chest. allowing the lungs to relax in the chest. And allowing the heart to relax in the chest. go in these areas the more you notice how effortless the body is in its processes of breathing and the heart beating doesn't matter how much you release effort those lungs still breathe all on their own that breath still comes and goes and the heart continues to beat there is an effortlessness to the way the body works, not a tension, but an easy effortlessness. You may notice this more and more as you let go. You may find as you run your attention along the left collarbone and the right collarbone and along the tops of the shoulders you may find that these shoulders are just allowing themselves to release back to the support beneath you Run your attention along the back of the body, letting the left shoulder blade, the right shoulder blade drop and release down. That space in between the shoulder blades, releasing any holding that it's been doing. Remembering that there's no pressure involved in relaxing and letting go. The body is allowed to just let go in its own time, to its own extent, and in its own way. As the shoulders release and relax, Allow yourself to become aware of the left upper arm and the right upper arm. And these are softening back just like the shoulders. Really feeling the presence of these areas of the body as I guide you to them. Such a simple and subtle sensation that requires a gentle attentiveness to pick up on. Feeling the presence of the left elbow around the outside, and that little crease through the inner arm on the inside of the elbow. down to the lower arms, feeling the 
feeling the top of the upper arm on the left side on the bottom or the inside of the arm on the left side never trying hard to concentrate but just simply allowing your attention to rest in these areas as we get to them Feeling the left wrist, releasing all the little muscles in and around that left wrist. Feeling into the left palm. the left hand the left thumb the left index finger middle finger ring finger and little finger release any tension from the whole of the left hand wrist upper arm the mind tries to tempt us away from the now moment. There's an intention to just be here with the body, with this process, knowing that there's nowhere else you need to be and nothing else you need to take care of in this moment. need to try to make anything happen and we definitely don't need to try to escape this moment for any reason let yourself be here as you bring your awareness to the right side from the right elbow feeling down through the upper part of the right arm inside of the right arm softening the right wrist feeling into the palm on the right side top upper part of the hand the right thumb index finger middle finger ring finger little finger feeling the presence of the whole of the right hand wrist and lower arm feeling 
feeling the presence of the whole of the left arm and hand. The whole of the right arm and hand. The shoulders, the chest, the torso, the hips, the legs, the feet. Feeling the presence of your body so strongly now. And feeling how the body sinks so deeply into the support beneath you that it even feels like the bones are becoming heavy and sinking back. your attention now to the throat feeling first of all the muscles around the outside of the neck around the front of the neck and around the back of the neck and then going in past the outside of the neck to the inner throat, feeling the muscles that run along the inside of the throat. And allowing all of these muscles around the outside of the neck and the inside of the throat to release any effort. We often hold in the throat when there are things we're not saying that we want to words, emotions that we are holding in or holding back. We allow this tension and this effort from the throat to be softened, even if it's just a little today. And as your jaw softens, Feel the presence of the lower jaw. Muscles at the joint, at the back of the jaw. Softening the muscles at the root of the tongue and throughout the rest of the tongue. of the mouth, pinning the bottom lip and the top lip. Pinning the left cheek and the right cheek. presence of the left ear and the right ear. And traveling back in along cheekbones to feel the presence of the nose, letting everything soften as you go.
deepening the feeling of air moving through the left nostril. And through the right nostril. feeling of the left eye left eyelid top and bottom even the subtle feeling of contact between the eyelids on the left side left eyebrow and then moving over to the right side pinning the right eye top and bottom eyelids contact between them the right eyebrow feeling the left temple the right temple Across the forehead, letting all of the muscles in the face soften as we allow any mask that we've been holding to just drop away. Traveling up through the back of the head along the top of the crown, down through the back, down to the neck, just feeling the presence of the whole of the skull, the whole of the head, maybe the contact between the back of the head and a cushion. As we feel the effortlessness and the softness in the body, we can feel that seeping into our internal environment now. Nothing to achieve or force. We are here to soften and surrender in this moment.
and I invite you now to bring a place to mind that you love, somewhere that you love to spend time. Don't try too hard to find this place, just somewhere where you feel safe and relaxed. So it may be a room in your house, it may be your favorite holiday spot, somewhere in a park. When you think of that place that you enjoy spending time, where you feel relaxed and safe and happy to be there. I want you to allow yourself to find a comfy seat in this scene. Maybe there's a cozy chair or a blanket laid out on the grass. It doesn't even have to make sense. Just allow yourself to find a comfy seat in your favorite place, in your safe place. And as you sit down into this seat and you notice how comfortable you feel and how happy you feel to be there. I want you to notice in more detail now what's around you. Are there buildings around you? Are there trees? Are you alone or are there people just peacefully milling around? Maybe there's sunlight, maybe the sky is blue. Maybe there's clouds in the sky. What color is the floor? What colors are there around you and the buildings and the details? Allow yourself time to really absorb this scene. All the while savoring being there in your happy place. And what can you smell in the air? fresh sea air, the smell of trees or plants or food, what smells come to mind as you sink yourself into this scene? and into this place. Is there anyone that you would like to have there with you? Somebody that makes you feel 
calm, relaxed and safe. This could be a person. This could be a pet curled up on your lap. This could even be an object, a particular cushion or blanket or item that brings you comfort. Savouring the experience of being in this safe, happy place. Maybe you feel more calm and relaxed on your own. Without people around you. You bring to mind whatever allows you to feel the most relaxed. This is your place. What can you feel as you sit there? Do you feel warm? Is there sunshine on your skin? Are you in comfortable clothes? Do you feel them gently moving and touching the skin if you move? Is there a gentle breeze that caresses the skin and feels cool and comfortable? Give yourself a little bit of time here in your safe, happy place. Put yourself there completely. Knowing that in your safe place, in your happy place, that there is nothing expected or needed from you. All that you need to do is just soak in this moment and enjoy the simple being, just being there. There's nothing to rush to or get to and there's nowhere else you need to be. After a little while of being here, maybe feeling uplifted, relaxed, I'm going to invite you to just gently bring yourself up from the seat that you're in, in this scene in your mind, and allow yourself to just zoom back and take one more look at this peaceful happy place and know in this moment that this place is always here for you whenever you need it and it occurs to you that you can visit this place and that this can be your restful place this can be the place where you come for a moment of effortlessness and surrender
It's a safe place where nothing is expected of you. It's a place for just a moment of being. And knowing that it's always there for you. You feel peaceful and reassured. Allow that scene to start to fall from your mind as you start to become aware once more of your physical body and the position that you're laying in. Maybe you allow yourself a couple of long deep breaths in through the nose all the way up to the top. And all the way down to the end. Noticing that although we took pressure and effort and striving, controlling, fixing away, noticing without that tension and without that kind of effort, that still something has shifted maybe physically maybe internally maybe both but noticing the difference in the way you feel from when you first lay down until now a little bit more aware now of the environment around you, of the room that you're in and the sounds around you. Maybe you start to feel ready to open the eyes just very, very slowly. Coming back to the space that you're in, taking in the scene around you. And know that the softening that was practiced and the surrender that was practiced during this last hour together is something that can absolutely linger and be brought with you into your day or into your evening. This is a quality and an energy that you can develop and carry around with you. Maybe you take some deeper breaths, maybe you begin to move. Maybe you treat yourself to a delicious Stretch out, bringing your arms up above your body and stretching through every inch, feeling the the difference in quality in your body, in your muscles, in your tissues. Just know that this yoga nidra practice is here for you whenever you need it. And if you would like to try some meditations, yoga nidras or yin yoga practices, there is plenty more on my channel, including a 21 day yin yoga challenge. I hope that this practice brought you benefit and I really enjoyed this space and time we had together, albeit virtually. Have a peaceful day or a peaceful evening. I will see you next time, my friends. Namaste.